Hey guys, in this video, we're going to take a look at how you can use the S Pen navigation gestures on the Samsung Galaxy S22 Ultra. First, let's go back to your home screen by pressing on the home button at the bottom of the screen. Then swipe down at the top and tap on the settings icon. In settings, go down and tap on advanced features. Then in here, we go down and tap on S Pen. Then at the top here, tap on Air Actions and make sure you turn on Air Actions to use navigation gestures. Now, once your phone is connected to your S Pen, you can see in here, it will tell you how you can use the navigation gestures. You can use the back, home, recent, smart select and screen right. Now, if you tap on the option key at the top here and then tap on learn how, in here, you can practice on how you can use the gestures, navigations. So tap on try it out at the bottom. And then in here, you can try to use it. So for example, it said, hold your S Pen with your fingertip like this, and then facing away from you, and then press and hold on the pen button, then flick your pen upward. So you just do it like this. And once, it's, um, once you have performed the correct gestures, it will go on to the next one. So in here, you can go back like this. And then next one is to right screen. So you just um, kind of like wiggles back and forth, back and forth. Um, in here, you can perform uh, a clockwise action to perform perhaps um, backward or forward or zoom uh, features. So you just go in a, an action like that. So you press on the button and hold onto the S Pen button. And then you just go into a, a circle, like a, like a circle, clockwise circle. And that's it. So once you have um, um, try it out once you have get used to once you have uh, practice and get used to the gestures you can then uh, use your s pen gestures uh, navigation so in here if we want to go back to the home screen so i'm going to tap on the back here you can see if we want to go back to the home screen we can kind of go up and down like that and that will allow you to go back to the home screen and you can also go to the recent menu open up the recent menu by pressing do this action right here and this will allow you to go to the open up the recent menu and you can also perform smart select or screen write or on the smart select basically allow you to capture the screen so i can just go like that and this will allow me to um, perform smart, smart select and from here i can um, select part of the screen or i can select the whole screen or i can just kind of like select part of the, the screen and then I can pin it. So there's a lot of things that you can do with um, this uh, smart captures. I can then close that. Let me see how I can close it. So this is basically just a pictures that I have pinned on my screen. So I'm just trying to find out how I can close this now. All right. So just trying to hold this. Can't do image into this app. So, okay, so when I tap on with my fingers, there is a small windows pop up right here that I can close. All right, so that's how you can use your S Pen navigation uh, gestures. Now, down here, if you want to change um, the navigation structure, you can do that as well. So, if uh, you want to change the back uh, features, you tap on that. And instead of going back, you can change this. Um, gestures to do something else such as perhaps maybe uh, create a new note or use the coloring uh, features on your device or write on calendar or perhaps maybe open up a, ca a camera app or gallery or internet so we can say open up the clock applications or open up Samsung note for example so if I do this action right here so I have my friend facing towards me and then if I go like that it will now open up the app on the device, the Samsung Notes on the device. And that's it. That is how you can use the navigation uh, gestures and how you can assign different uh, functions to each of the different gestures on the, uh, on the S Pen. Now the S Pen is only available on the Samsung Galaxy S 22 Ultra. If you are using the Galaxy S uh, 22 or the 22 Plus, uh, you do not have the S Pen unfortunately. And that's it. Thank you for watching this video.
please subscribe to my channel for more videos.